Hey there, everybody. Welcome here one more time with me, Rodrigo Ferreira, international trader. Uh, if you're first time here, subscribe, share, give some likes if you enjoy. Uh, if you're not a first time, welcome back again. Help us to get these informations. We have some video in Portuguese. Our company is based in Brazil. Uh, we have agro-business news, but today we'd like to talk a very informal uh, subject, but very important for me. I would like to have it, uh, uh, to take it for you for some days ago. Uh, I will try to get this video more detail for some points that I would like, but today I will try just uh, to give some information because something happened today uh, and this morning again and uh, it's annoying a lot but first of all we'd like uh, to talk about a little bit about me you know me maybe not very deep my name is Rodrigo Ferreira Quintela I am an international trader, uh, custom brokers and consulant uh, I'm uh, graduated here in uh, Brazil from the UNIPCV uh, international trader uh, we have graduation from Massachusetts International Business, for international trade, uh, international business, international market, and uh, international business consulant. Uh, my company has more than 20 years uh, uh, experience uh, in international business in commercial area. We work uh, uh, in commodities. From Brazil, most of them in the South America, most of them is food. Uh, we also work uh, uh, with some manufacturers, but again with the food. But of course, we have a main experience and we have offices and partners all around the world, also in China, that uh, we provide uh, inspection in factory. We help people to import from China to Brazil. Uh, if you know a little bit some of my presentation, the company probably you heard it many times. The mission of us is connect the business globally. We repeat all of the time in most of our videos. Our vision is a strategy with results. So if you are a buyer or if you are a seller and really would like to have a reliable supplier or partnership, you can contact us because you need to be sure about your money and about your business. If you want a good supplier or seller, or if you have a, a reliable, reliable uh, buyer now with all the procedures respected for many business now. And the last one, uh, honest respect and a good practice. That I would like to talk a little bit. Let me take, uh, uh, just uh, I will try to show you some uh, information here is about this now. Uh, I can see many videos, I can see many information from all people around the world now that I would like to take in the next video about it to the scammers, uh, liars or different things. I would like to try a little bit with more detail in these other videos because you need to be very careful about these kind of things. And first of all, you need to not play the dirty games. Okay, let's do the business with fair. Show who you are, okay? Uh, but for some people, it's very difficult to work in this way because uh, they are fake scammers, or maybe they are not a scammer, but they are liars, and they don't know how to play a good game, you know? Uh, in this morning, I would like to show and try to see if you can have the information now about uh, this guy here uh, let me see if you can see okay this logo okay there is the name of the company the telephone i don't know if it's gonna be very easy to show all the conversation here but every company they have some procedures and i think you need to respect it you have three options Okay, when somebody contact me by social media or WhatsApp, I have an automatic answer and what I want, a lot of information. Uh, if you 
agree okay you send to me first option if you don't agree you can negotiate with me second option if you don't agree and don't accept it no problem go away we have many sellers many people all around the world that probably some of them can accept your procedures but why are we talking about that because I, I will not be talking about everybody now is famous scammers but this word not exactly very being used in the right way it's not a scammer who bring you something that's not your procedures or something that you cannot accept it you can say no uh, if they decided to not accept it, some payment terms it still means that time is coming very quickly because I posted something about that is cover you need to fake document or you sell something that you don't have you know that your buyer is fake and you do business with them so uh, most of the people and this guy here uh, he asked me I, I told you here's one time I need official why I need official okay uh, law, LOI, letter of intention, law, how you decide to call, or sometimes the CPO, because you need to not waste time. We need to know if the buy is real. What I call those people is paper makers. We have the people, they don't care about the document, they don't check the document, the date, stamp it, sign it, who is it from. They don't know. They don't know if the buyer is still interested in to make this business. So he wasted his time and it wastes the time of other people that just want to work it okay so that's why when we can make a compliance i don't want to jump you i don't want uh, uh, to go directly to your buyer because they respect it we are mediator uh, the difference maybe between is because we do compliance from the product we sell and from the buyer but we have many people also because you now to the pandemic that they just started this business and they jump in it think that they're gonna get millionaire in one day because they want very big commissions uh, 5, 10, 20, 30 dollars in just one time in, and they don't care about which commodity it is uh, they don't check anything and just think that if he's forward the document and get the information they will sell Sometimes when I get some information like this in my mind, I think, oh, maybe I could say yes from those people. Don't matter what the answer, those guys, they will never get you a real business because they are not with the buyer. They don't know the buyer. The buyer don't trust him. They have like 10 persons between him. So that's why we don't want to waste our time and your time. You need to work in the right way of the business because if you're gonna waste the time, you're gonna get boring in three months, you're gonna leave the job. You can make money, it's not easy, but you need to be focused. Okay, so that's why we request some information. And one time he asked, two times they say, No, I will not call. Of course, when we trust on the people and we have a good relationship with this partner, this broker, mediator, trader. We can give you some information. Oh, Rodrigo, how, what about the price of the corner today? Oh, the chicken pass. Okay, I, I, I made a deal with this price. But it's the first contact. I don't know you. I don't know if it's, you are reader, real. I don't know if you are a scammer. I don't know uh, about anything about you or your buyer. We needed to start it, trust it, one each other. Okay, and this with the, those information. So for more than one time I asked him about uh, the full information so I can, okay, check, oh, it's real, I'm gonna waste my time and we try to conclude the deal. Uh, after many uh, askies and he trying and trying, I say, a real deal and price, no speculation. So that's why I need it. So he sent to me some documents and the problem you can see that see not very easy but documents that uh, let me see the next one that's not official okay very old so they don't check any 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 informations about the document is he sent 
And if he is he's sharing one document that was adulterated and uh, not allowed by the buyer, so he is a scammer in this time. Okay? And of course we're going to talk to the buyer because we need to make a compliance. We're not jumping anyone. I don't need to have a contract signed to pay commission for anyone. Of course, we work with the NEC, NEGA, EM, FPA, we have no circulation. But you need to understand that, that uh, uh, your principle, okay, your value, respect, and good practice is the first one. Because I have uh, many contracts signed with uh, many people and uh, now we need to fight in the court to get the money or for something. So I, I answered him because he was, again, I went and I say no, I cannot send it, it for you, okay, because it's not okay. Uh, this lawyer uh, and the required spot delivery, sir, you have to issue a FCO. I don't have to issue nothing for my company, okay? The procedures, procedures is LOI, letter of intention, if I want, most of the time I don't do, you can send a soft corporation offer. Most of the time, I just give all the information. If you accept it, you need to send us an ICPO with a proof of fund, depending on the business. After that, I send you FCO. Or I can go directly to the SPA. You sign. I don't ask any uh, bank instrument open before you have the proof of the goods, SPA, visit, the inspection, everything, bank, bank, but we cannot just send it because we have what we call those people FCO renters and they take your document, they don't have any buyer and they started to share your name, your document, adulterate it and they send for many people. So that's why we don't do this. Just to be very clear. So I answered him. I'm gonna try to show you just to prove that's real. Okay, try to see. Okay, and I said, I'm not very sure that's uh, clear for you, but I said, no thanks. When send the ICPO with RWA, we send the FCO. This is our procedures. Okay, I send many times for many clients. So he says, I'm sorry about to bring this for you. You are an idiot. If you sitting near to me, I slap it on you. Dump. I would like to understand. Let me see if you can really see this word. It's not very clear, but up to now I read, you can have an idea. I would like to understand who is this guy? He's a scammer. He's a drug dealer. He is not a, a professional person, not a polite, not a fair. How can we do business with some people like this? Because they say that they will not send the FCO for him. And started to do many bad things, bad words about me. And he said, you never get bank information in law or with law. Yes, I can. Loy and ICPO nowadays is almost the same document. In the back, you could see ECPO, irrevocable. It's fake. They don't use it, so it's a just a document. The bank information, what are you going to do with your bank information? I'm going to see that's the buyer, it's real. When I send my FCO, you're going to have from the factory, from the trading, all the bank information because you need to make the compliance if you don't know the, how, how work this business, no? And uh, what I can do, then do this, what then the scammers do with the FCO? So I already told it to you. I am working with more than 100 sellers, even milers. I never asked anyone. Okay, so again, is the principle, is the good practice, is the respecting. If you don't agree with my procedures, if you don't accept my pricing, if you don't accept my payment terms, and you have 100 or mid or 1000 of a business, no problem. You go with those people, but don't waste my time. Don't suit me. Okay? This is not. 
I mean, I have my face for everyone. I have my name. I have all my informations. And again, if somebody has something to talk about, I ask you, okay, go on my website, open all of them and write for me. Say for me, prove that I am a scammer. Okay? I challenge you again, one more time. Because it's very easy uh, to say things from the people but without any proof. So, uh, this is my message. I think the video was a little bit larger, but I would like to bring this for you. I will try to the next one more formal uh, to bring some of these information about procedures, payment, about these that is kind of scammers, liars, paper makers. They are completely different, okay? Let's not put all of these in just one bag. Uh, it's a very different video from the, the, that I used to do, but I hope you enjoy this. Let your comments here uh, on YouTube, LinkedIn, everywhere, and I hope to see you for my next video. Thank you so much, Rodrigo Ferreira, International Trading, and again, here we connect the business globally. We respect it good prices, principles, and the strategy with results. I see you next year. Thank you so much.